Hey, we're, we're Scarlett O'Hara, O'Hara and, and you're, you're watching punkvideosrock.com. What's up, guys? Robert O'Hara here with punkvideosrock.com, hanging out with Scarlett O'Hara at the Glass House. Yeah. What's up, guys? Uh, How's, it going, man? How's the tour coming along so far? I know it's, it's still really fresh. Yeah, so far it's been pretty good. Uh, lack of sleep most of the time. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but this overall has been pretty legit. All the bands been amazing. Free pizza every Free day. Free pizza every oh, day. Yeah, meeting that just, definitely helps. Yeah, it's really cool though. Like it's, I know it's still still the first uh, first what week we've been in, so it's yeah. pretty it's pretty going pretty good. How's the weather been so far? Oh, uh, it was it was bad in the south and Texas. Two outdoor venues and uh, yeah. Arizona was just Texas. Killing. Texas yeah, just killing. killed us, dude. dude. Like but, uh, sweat everywhere. Nice day we oh, had. Man, really nice. Yeah, definitely. That's cool. That's cool. So like going back to the band. Um, how did the band form? Um, it started out as uh, the lead screamer Eddie and uh, the clean guitarist who sings uh, Renee. Mm-hmm. They started out a long time ago before they met any of us, and then we just kind of all slowly trickled in. I think it was me after that, and then him, and then just kind of all fell together. Yeah, we came. We went through a few drummers before we yeah. found our Arnie, the main drummer. So it was a little struggle for that, but once we finally got him in, it was set. Nice, mm-hmm. nice, nice. So, wh- like, what are the influence of the band? Like, where do you guys get all your, your style from? Um, I don't know. I mean, uh, just a lot of, like, just Prada, Brim of the Horizon, Underworld, just kind of trying to throw all that in together and just a lot of different stuff. We're always getting influenced by new bands that are coming out. Like, right now, I'm, I'm really digging the new Greeley Estates album. Okay. Yeah, uh, also, Till has been yeah, my influence. Till guys are definitely. amazing. I have, I have yet to check them out, but dude, I definitely you'd amazing. be blown away, dude, once every, you see them. Every night, they every night, no. Really. Awesome guys, too. Awesome yeah, guys. Nice. And it's, it's a solid tour as well. So yeah, dude, the tour is just sick, man. I can't believe it. This is our first tour ever, so yeah. Like, I'm glad we're like we're playing with amazing bands like these. Nice. So that was actually gonna be my next question. Like, how, how does it feel? You know, first tour, and it's a pretty big tour. Yeah, dude. So like, yeah. you know, how, how do you feel as far as you know, you're on the road, for so long? Um, I mean. It's, it's definitely a change. I mean, it's definitely being a, it's different, you know, going place to place every day and new crowds and, but I mean, it's going good, you know, we're, we're learning a lot as we go and it's, it's just right now, I think it's just a really big learning experience. And, yeah. Uh, but you know, it's just, it's going great and it's, it gets better every day and can't wait to jump on another one after this no, and seriously. just keep going. Keep yeah. Going. Seriously. So let's, uh, you guys found out you guys were going on tour. What's, what's the number one thing you made sure that you brought for tour? Um, snacks. We gotta have snacks, dude, because like lots of underwear. Yeah, and lots of you underwear. Never know when you're gonna clean your clothes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that that gets pretty crazy. When, when was the last shower? Oh. Um, actually, no. I uh, we showered two days ago. A couple of guys showered today. Um, we, I have an aunt that lives in LA, like okay. 30 minutes from here. Traffic like an hour, but yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, it, it hasn't been too bad. Yeah. I, the longest I've gone though. Man, I'd have to say about four days. Yeah, same here. Not it's it's say, not yeah, not proud. It's it's pretty bad, but still like. Got to change your good. clothes, but the no, shower. As long as you have to change your good clean change of underwear, you'll be set. You know. You I keep hearing like baby powders like. Yes, that bed. really helps, it dude. It helps. Um, it helps itchiness. Yeah. Yes, <laughs> it helps a lot. Definitely nice, dude. Well, as far as uh, as far as the name goes, um, how did you guys come up with the name? Um. The guitarist came up with it, and uh, it's kind of just like it's based on the uh, the girl from the movie Scarlet O'Hara, Gone with the Wind. Okay. And um, it's just about like kind of just throwing yourself up as top as you can, and just you know never holding back. You just you always got to get to the top, and she did whatever she could to get to the top. Nice, nice, cool. And uh, you guys, you guys were just in the studio recently. Oh yeah, we finished about a week and a half ago. We were in Portland, Oregon for a month recording our first full length. Nice. And it's coming out amazing. I gotta yeah. say, like we. Barely got our two mixes in from from those recordings, and oh, dude, it's just so amazing. I just can't wait for the album to drop. Nice. What are we expecting from that album? Like, um, <laughs> it sounds better than our old stuff. Yes, you gotta say that. It's um, way better than what we have. Really, really catchy, really heavy. I mean, just a little bit of everything you want to hear, mm-hmm. really. And, um, you know, we've all definitely grown as musicians completely. And, um, I mean, it, it's, it's really awesome. I, I can't wait to, for it to come out. Definitely super stoked how do you guys work on as far as you know writing the album um do you guys all you know collaborate as far as you know lyrically and you know musically or how does that work out with you guys yeah um it's it starts out with a lot of guitar parts and then um you vocals it's it's mainly eddie and renee yeah uh, they, they, they usually they just vocals. get together themselves and to uh, write or they'll just separate and write their own thing and put it together so it's usually 
it's separate when we write and then we all bring it together okay. so it's that's really how we write sometimes we'll all work as one musically and just leave the lyrics out to the end but other than that like it's all like we write our own stuff and then we bring it in and we show it and we give our input Cool, cool. So definitely excited to, to hear that out. What, what's the release date? Do you guys have one yet? Um, well, we do. We have one, but yeah. it's not steady it's and we're not it's yeah. supposed to announce it. Cause okay. yeah. So it's still happens. in the download. Yeah, it's still in the download right now. Cool, cool. Well, we'll definitely be looking out for it. So um, after this tour um, is over, what, what can we expect with you guys? What's coming on? Uh, we're already uh, talking to Artery as far as another tour after this, but um, nothing's for sure yet. They don't want us to say anything because... Yeah. It's still all in the works. We'll see what's going on. <laughs> well, thanks for that, guys. You guys no want to drop uh, your MySpace website, whatever? Uh, oh, yeah. yeah it's uh, myspace.com slash Scarlett O'Hara Music. We also have a Twitter. It's uh, Scarlett O'Hara Texas. Just follow us. Do always updating all the time to let you guys know what we're doing. Uh, other than that, dude, just keep Facebook. on the lookout. Facebook. We have Facebook, Facebook too. too. Just Scarlett O'Hara on Facebook. You should find yeah. it. Just keep on the lookout for the album. It's coming out in a couple months, so be prepared. And don't download it. Don't download it. <laughs> <Gotta buy> it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>